Hello there. We had some severe dust storms to start the week and, in fact, end the weekend across parts of the Arabian Peninsula. We could well see some further dense dust storms in the coming few days. Whilst across India, we're having an early taste of summer with the temperatures here. But let's head our way further northwards, first of all, where we've got some further heavy showers to contend with of snow, even at fairly low levels around the Black Sea and through parts of Turkey, Armenia and Georgia as well. Across the Caspian Sea, temperatures are a little bit higher, but nevertheless, we'll see that colder weather working working its way gradually eastwards towards the weekend. So although temperatures have recovered above freezing in Kabul, temperatures will start to fall away towards the weekend as that, as I say, that stormy weather heads its way gradually eastwards. And with it, the winds are really whipping up as well. So some further dust storms around and some of the rain could be quite significant and give some flash flooding. Now ahead of that, we've got some rather nasty storms up in the northeast of India and also through the southern tip and into Sri Lanka as well. But by and large, as I mentioned, we've had an early taste of summer. Temperatures soaring up towards 40 degrees to some parts of the Western Ghats. They are a little lower than that this week, but still 34 in Bangalore. The forecast does see some uh, cooler weather coming into Riyadh, as I mentioned, behind that weather system lifting the dust as well. So that's an indication of what's to happen. Even some rather cold conditions near freezing as we go through the night time. Delhi up to 30, though, by Sunday.